Welcome, everyone, to a great Sunday night with the NBA here on 2K Sports. This is Kevin Harlan with Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. And joining us in a bit later from the sidelines, Doris Burke. Now a chance to check out our starting lineups. First for Philadelphia. And it's seven-footer Joel Embiid, 2014's number three overall pick, looking to make his mark inside. And it's Sarge, and it's the four slot. And for Philadelphia. And it's seven-footer Joel Embiid, 2014's number three overall pick, looking to make his mark inside. And it's Sarge, and it's the power forward. So Philadelphia will get the first possession. He dishes it to Simmons. That one's rebounded by MB. Terrific job that time defending at the rim. I mean, it's not an easy task stopping that fellow when he's headed to the bucket like that. Good job. Now here's Redding. Pass to Sarge. Lock at six. And it's blocked. Our starting lineups will look at the matchups here and who we'll see for our starting five for both teams. First for the Bucks, Chris Middleton is out there with Ante Tacumbo. And playing at center, the 6'11", big man out of Georgetown. Versatile score, terrific pass, Greg Monroe. Then it's Jabari Parker, and it's Parker in at the four. And for the Bucks, Chris Middleton is out there with Ante Tacumbo. And playing at center, the 6'11", big man out of Georgetown. Versatile score, terrific pass, Greg Monroe. Then it's Jabari Parker, and it's Parker in at the four. So the Bucks win the tip. Feeds to Middleton. The three. Milwaukee with the rebound. Passes it to Brogdon. He kicks it to Antetokounmpo. Here's the pass to Maker. Back to Antetokounmpo. Shot clock at five. Pass to Brogdon. Fires the three. And a great assist by Ant A quick check now the starting five for both teams. Okay, first for the Bulls. Miritich out there with Robin Lopez. And it's Miritich in at the four. And for Chicago, Miritich out there with Robin Lopez. And it's Miritich in at the four side. Welcome, everyone, to NBA Basketball here on 2K Sports. Tonight, it's Noche Latina, celebration of Latin culture in the league. It's become an annual tradition and a very good one. This is Kevin Harlan alongside Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. And it's Chicago to start out. Here's Dunn. Back to Miritich. There's the triple. And he gets it to go. Miritich has got the first bucket of the game with the three for Chicago. Now the Bulls with it. It's a three-point game. Wade outside. Back 
to Miritic. Reverses, and it's Lopez laying it in. And Steve, you look at him, he is a banger. I mean, he really enjoys the physical aspect of the game. It's an exciting Sunday night edition of the NBA on 2K Sports. Joined in the booth with Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony, this is Kevin Hart. And now a quick check of our starting lineup for both teams. First, for the Cavaliers. Kevin Love out there with Tristan Thompson. We've got Channing Fry. Tonight, we'll see him work to establish that all-important presence under the glass. Then there's Amon Shepard. And it's Love in at the four-man position. And then for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Kevin Love out there with Tristan Thompson. We've got Channing Fry, a very solid big man who'll be making every effort to control the glass and make some big plays under the rim. Then there's Amon Shumper, and it's Love in at the four. So Cleveland will get the first possession. Irving kicks to Love. Love with the screen for James. Thompson outside. Back to James. Beyond the arc. The shot misses. And Cleveland will come the other way. Love with the screen on Smith. Irving drives in. James outside. Let's it go from deep. Here's Thompson. And foul called as he misses. He'll go to the line and shoot two. And I also can't get over how much energy he expends rebounding the basketball. He goes... It's an exciting Sunday night edition of the NBA on 2K Sports. Kevin Harlan here along with Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. Now a chance to check out tonight's starting lineups. First for the Celtics, Hayward out there with Jake Crowder. Then there's Horford, and it's Crowder in at the four. And for Boston, Hayward out there with Jake Crowder. Then there's Horford, and it's Crowder in at the four spot. It'll be the Celtics off the tip. Thomas kicks to Smart. Outside for Thomas. Horford with a screen on Thomas. Smart dishes to Thomas. Five to shoot. The Celtics need to get a shot off. Here's Crowder. No good with the triple. And here's Boston. Thomas goes in, into Al Horford. And we see a while ago, the Clippers prepared for the task at hand. Yeah! Welcome to 2K Sports for another edition of NBA Basketball. Along with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg, this is Kevin Hart. And now a quick check of our starting lineups for both teams. First for Los Angeles, Griffin is out there with DeAndre Jordan. We've got Jordan. He brings a very important inside presence to this team, a mainstay in their offensive and defensive strategies. Then it's Mbamute, and it's Griffin in at the four. And for the Clippers, Griffin is out there with DeAndre Jordan. We've got Jordan. We will see him go to work on that low block, one of the great centers right now in the league. Then it's Mbamute, and it's Griffin in at the four spot. It'll be Los Angeles off the tip. Beverly against Beverly. Now Griffin inside. And he gets it to go. Griffin's got the opening bucket of the night here for the Clippers. And something else everybody loves about him is his ability to do this sensational and spectacular. His dunk simply defied description at times. Williams for three. Jordan with the rebound. Ladies and gentlemen. And the Lakers going through their pregame routines. Welcome to Noche Latina here in the NBA. A Latin flavor to the night's festivity as we get ready to go. This is Kevin Harlan with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg alongside. And our sideline reporter tonight is Doris Burke. 
our starting lineup to look at the matchups here and who we'll see for our starting five for both teams. First for the Lakers. They've got world peace. You simply have to respect the tremendous skill he has down low, the work ethic and athletic ability to make a big impact under the board. Then it's Corey Brewer, and it's Randall in at the four. And then for the Los Angeles Lakers, they've got world peace. He'll be looking to control the boards tonight and provide that key offensive production from inside. Then it's Corey Brewer, and it's Randall in at the power forward position. Tip-off goes to the Lakers. Lopez a screen. This is to Caldwell Pope. And the three off target. The pass to Ball. Leads him in there. Nice passing here by Los Angeles. From deep. And that one's good. And they are on the board first. Trying to set the tone here early. I like that. Here's Ingram. All systems go. The Grizzlies primed and ready to play. Get up, Welcome, sports fans. Thanks for joining us. And it's time for NBA Basketball on 2K Sports. This is Kevin Harlan alongside Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. We've got a chance now for our starting lineups from point guard to center. This game should be a good one. First for the Grizzlies. Carter is out there with Ben McLemore. And inside out of North Carolina, the always dangerous long arm, Brandon Wright. And it's Martin in at the power forward. And then for the Memphis Grizzlies, Carter is out there with Ben McLemore. And inside out of North Carolina, the always dangerous long arm, Brandon Wright. And it's Martin in at the four spot. So Memphis will get the first possession. Conley kicks to Martin. Back to Conley. Dishes to Martin. Memphis moving it around. Back to Conley. Shot clock at six. And that one's good. Back to Gasol. Pass to Conley. Our starting lineup to look at the matchups here and who we'll see for our starting five for both teams. First for Atlanta, they've got Bellinelli, a very solid big man who'll be making every effort to control the glass and make some big plays under the rim. And Atelia Silva in at the power forward. And for Atlanta, they've got Bellinelli. He'll be battling over the boards to get the job done, both on offense and defense. And Atelia Silva in at the power forward position. It's the NBA. Welcome to our Sunday night broadcast here on 2K Sports. This is Kevin Harlan alongside Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg. And it's the Hawks to start out. Now here's Schroeder. Feeds to Baseman. It's stolen by Schroeder. By himself. Now that's how to finish the break. Throw down with push. <laughs> Quick hands on the steal and then just mad hops on the slam. Great sequence for them defensively and part offensively. Well, one usually leads to the other, Kevin. That's just good, aggressive, attacking basketball at both ends. And so it's the Hawks getting on the board first. They set the pick into Ilyasova. He got an advantage there off the pick and took it right in. Great job of screening there. Nice job to take it to the rim and get the finish. And so it's Atlanta with it. And play stops. Whistle on what looks to be an illegal screen. 
Well, that was a quick foul for him there. The refs are certainly calling it close. On defense, the Hawks. Doris Burke has an update for us. Doris? I was able to talk with Mike Budenholzer for just a moment. I asked him what the key difference is between these teams, and he said there really isn't much of a difference. Watching them on tape is like looking in the mirror, and he admitted they had a very tough time preparing. And a thoughtful moment indeed. The national anthem and a crowd anxiously awaiting the tip-off. Hi, everyone. Thanks for joining us for Noche Latina, the NBA celebration of the Latin heritage, both among its players and fans. This is Kevin Harlan alongside Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony with Doris Burke on our sideline. The starting five for our game. Here are tonight's starting lineups. First for the Heat. Then there's Wayne Ellington. And it's Johnson in at the four. And for Miami. Then there's Wayne Ellington. And it's Johnson in at the four spot. It'll be the Heat off the tip. Dragic against Dragic. And Waiters kicks to Dragic. The 17-footer. And Winslow pulls it down. You, you almost have to assume he's going to knock those down when he is that open. Outside Dragic. Johnson outside. Winslow. The feet to Whiteside. And Winslow pulls it down. Excellent. Really solid job, actually, by the defense to get in his way as he was going up for that one. Thank you for tuning in this Sunday evening. This is Kevin Harlan alongside Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg. We've got a chance now for our starting lineups from point guard to center. This game should be a good one. First for Charlotte. Michael Kid Gilchrist out there with Howard. We've got Marvin Williams. He'll be looking to control the boards tonight and provide that key offensive production from inside. Then it's Cody Zeller, and it's Kid Gilchrist in at the four spot. And then for the Charlotte Hornets, I go Kid Gilchrist out there with Howard. We've got Marvin Williams, always giving them a fantastic effort from the paint. They count on his skill and determination to get it done inside. Then it's Cody Zeller, and it's Kid Gilchrist in at the four spot. Pass to Walker. Howard with a screen on Walker. Rejected by Walker. Four on the clock. Another shot. And he gets the bucket. Kid Gilchrist has got the first points in the scoreboard for the Hornets. And how about that? Just an easy way to get on the board. And just like that, Greg, the first lead belongs to them. And it's Walker penetrating. And foul called as he misses. He'll go to the line. And, and there's a shot earlier of the Jazz preparing for action. Thank you for tuning in this Sunday evening. With Greg Anthony and Clark Hill. This is Kevin Harlan. And Doris Burks on the sideline as well. a chance to check out our starting lineups. First for the Jazz. Johnson is out there with Rudy Gobert. We've got Boris Diaw. You simply have to respect the tremendous skill he has down low, the work ethic and athletic ability to make a big impact under the boards. Then there's Favors, and it's Johnson in at the four slot. And looking at Utah, Johnson is out there with Rudy Gobert. We've got Boris Diaw. He'll be looking to control the boards tonight and provide that key offensive production from inside. Then there's Favors, and it's Johnson in a power forward position. And it's going to be the Jazz off the tip. They double-team Johnson. Hood can't get it to go. And, and, and typically, he has the touch to finish when he's in tight, but not sure on that possession. Back to Rubio. And the pass to Johnson. Nice ball movement by Utah. Hood kicks to Rubio. Johnson for three. 
Joe Johnson pulls it in. On defense, Utah. Let's find out what Doris Burke has for. And the players doing a little talking here before tip-off. It's all in good fun right now. Let's hear it. It's the NBA on 2K Sports as we get set to bring you all the action. This is Kevin Harlan alongside Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony with Doris Burke on our sideline. A quick check now for starting five for both teams. First for Sacramento. Hill is up there with Costa Coots. We've got Tyreek Evans. He'll be battling over the boards to get the job done, both on offense and defense. Then it's Garrett Temple, and it's Randolph in at the power forward position. And for Sacramento, Hill is up there with Costa Coots. We've got Tyreek Evans. They'll be watching him, boxing out, and maneuvering for the easy baskets inside. They'll be counting, certainly, on his production. Then it's Garrett Temple, and it's Randolph in at the four. So Sacramento will get the first possession. Hill kicks to Cauley Stein. Fox, shot on the wing, misses off the left iron. You know, that's a problem he has. I mean, not being able to knock down that open jumper. I think it happens far too often. The shot is off. And Sacramento will go the other way with it. Picked by Randall. Welcome to Noche Latina here in the NBA. A Latin flavor to the night's festivity as we get ready to go. Along with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg, this is Kevin Harlan. We've got a chance now for our starting lineups from point guard to center. This game should be a good one. First for the Knicks. Vujicic is out there with Hardaway. Then it's Anthony, and it's Brzingis in at the four slot. And for New York, Vujicic is out there with Hardaway. Then it's Anthony, and it's Brzingis in at the power forward. And so off the tip, it's New York. Anthony with it. Dishes to Hardaway. Left side, Hardaway. Anthony. No good with the triple. You know what, though? Sometimes you can be too open. I think it may have surprised him, and that's why he missed. to Persingas. Right side Hardaway. Six to shoot. New York needs to get off a shot. Takes a three. Persingas can't hit. New York with the ball. How good a Doris Burke who had a chance to talk with that. Welcome everyone to NBA basketball here on 2K Sports. Tonight it's Noche Latina, celebration of Latin culture in the league. It's become an annual tradition and a very good one. This is Kevin Harlan with Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. And joining us in a bit later from the sidelines, Doris Burke. And now a quick check of our starting lineups for both teams. First for the Magic, Bismack Biambo is out there with Terrence Ross. And it's Gordon in at the four slot. And for Orlando, Bismack Biambo is out there with Terrence Ross. And it's Gordon in at the four-man position. Magic start out with the ball. Payton drives in. And Fournier kicks to Payton. Payton left side. The pass to Fournier. Shot clock at six. Can't get it to go. The Magic go the other way with it. Peyton passes to Fournier. 
And there's the feed to Gordon. Orlando needs to get off a shot. The shot. Fournier's shot is off. That's a shot he's got to hit. You don't get many looks better from that range. Mucho gusto, and welcome to Noche Latina on 2K Sports. From the jerseys to the food to the halftime entertainment tonight, a distinctive Latin flavor. This is Kevin Harlan with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg and our sideline reporter, Doris Burke. A quick check now at the starting five for both teams. First for Dallas. They've got Noel. You simply have to respect the tremendous skill he has down low, the work ethic and athletic ability to make a big impact under the boards. And it's Nowitzki in at the power forward. And then for the Dallas Mavericks. They've got Noel. He'll be looking to control the boards tonight and provide that key offensive production from inside. And it's Nowitzki in at the four spot. So Dallas will get the first possession. The shot is off. And it's Dallas the other way. Just five to shoot. Number one. They get it back. Another shot with one on the clock. And count it. Two points with a chance for one more at the free throw line. His hard work on the backboard really just has given them more opportunities to score. He is a persistent defender too, Steve. I mean, even if he gets caught behind on the break, he'll bust his behind to get back into the play and maybe come up with a block at the last second. Let's send it out to Doris Burke, who caught up with head coach Rick Carlisle. Doris? Kevin, as you know, this team is... Hello, fans. Welcome to this presentation of the NBA Sunday Night Action right here on 2K Sports. Hi, this is Kevin Harlan, joined by my partners Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg. A quick check now to starting five for both teams. First for the Nets, Trevor Booker is out there with Jeremy Lin. And it's Hollis Jefferson in at the four. And for Bonets, Trevor Booker is out there with Jeremy Lin. And it's Hollis Jefferson in at the power forwards position. the Nets off the tip. Here's Levert. Back to Russell. Feeds it to Mazda. Kicks it to Russell. Nice ball movement by Brooklyn. Six to shoot. Mazda passes to Russell. Levert grabs the miss. That's the kind of deed you need when he's got the ball near the hoop. They were all over. Outside, Russell. Pass to Levert. Back to Russell. Elbow shot. No good. And Brooklyn will now go the other way with it. Welcome, sports fans. Thanks for joining us. And it's time for NBA Basketball on 2K Sports. Joined in the booth with Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony, this is Kevin Harlan. And now a quick check of our starting lineups for both teams. First for Denver, and it's Mason Plumlee, a bouncy 6'11 big man out of Duke, and in the middle. Then there's Kenneth Fareed, and it's Millsap in at the four spot. And then for the Denver Nuggets, 
and it's Mason Plumwood, the bouncy 6'11 big man out of Duke, panning the middle. Then there's Kenneth Fareed, and it's Millsap in at the foursome. So the Nuggets win the tip. Nuggets. Here's Murray. He's covered by Murray. Harris outside. Passes it to Chandler. Back to Harris. Shot clock at six. And the jumper is on the mark. Nice make for him as they get the scoring started. Yeah, he gets it going, and who knows now? You know, it might be a, a really big night in store for him. Here's Murray. Harris outside. Releases. Kenneth Fareed pulls it in. That's not a sight you see very often. I mean, he has a great feel for that jump shot. And a good nature back and forth between the players while we wait to get this one underway. Play! Hello and welcome everyone to another exciting edition of the NBA on 2K Sports. This is Kevin Harlan with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg alongside. And our sideline reporter tonight is Doris Burke. The starting five for our game. Here are tonight's starting lineups. First, for the Pacers, they've got Turner always giving them a fantastic effort from the paint. They count on his skill and determination to get it done inside. And it's Young in at the four-man position. And for Indiana, they've got Turner. He'll be looking to control the boards tonight and provide that key offensive production from inside. And it's Young in at the power forwards position. The Pacers start off with the ball. Collison against Collison. Outside Turner. Back to Collison. Indiana moving it around. The shoot. He dishes it to Oladipo. The 19-foot shot. And the shot is long. You're not going to see that very often. Plenty of space, but he just, let's face it, he whiffs on that one. Collison kicks to Turner. Bogdanovich sinks the triple. Bogdanovich has got his first three points of the game. And they get the first bucket. And they'll hope that sets the tone at the offensive end going forward. It doesn't always work out that way, but better to start fast than not. All right, let's go over to the sideline with Doris Burke. Well, Kevin, Nate McMillan gave me a few minutes to catch up with them. Doing a good job staying tight on their perimeter shooters is something that he wants his guys to focus on. He knows how much this team can hurt you if you give them too much room on the perimeter, and they're determined not to let that happen in this one, gentlemen. And the players getting together for a little chat as we're just about ready to get going here. It's an exciting Sunday night edition of the NBA on 2K Sports. Hi, this is Kevin Harlan, joined by my partners, Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg. Now a chance to check out our starting lineup. First for the Pelicans, DeMarcus Cousins out there with Bonnie Yunus. Then there's Quincy Pondexter, and it's Davis in at the fourth. And for New Orleans, DeMarcus Cousins out there with Bonnie Yunus. Then there's Quincy Pondexter, and it's Davis in at the four shot. Tip-off goes to New Orleans. Stolen by Cousins. Puts it up from 12. And he hits the jump shot. Cousins has got the first points up on the board for the Pelicans. 
New Orleans on D. Outside Rondo. The pass to Holiday. Dishes it to Cousins. Cousins is there. Six to shoot. Nice D from Cousins. And you can see the defenders afraid to kind of get in his way a lot of times when he's on his way to the basket. But on that one, they were there. Now here is Hill. Back to Holiday. Davis setting the pick for Holiday. Fires from the wing. Pelicans pull it in. About one minute into the first quarter. Outside Rondo. Back to Holiday. Outside Rondo. Feeds it to Davis. And there's the slam dunk to finish it off. I tell you what, you gotta love his aggressiveness finishing inside like that. Well, his leaping at And there a bit earlier, the Pistons getting mentally and physically ready to play. Hello and welcome everyone to another exciting edition of the NBA on 2K Sports. This is Kevin Harlan alongside Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony with Doris Burke on our sideline. A quick check now for starting lineup for both teams. First for Detroit, Andre Drummond is out there with this Smith. Then it's John Luer, and it's Luer in at the four spot. And for the Pistons, Andre Drummond is out there with this Smith. Then it's John Luer, and it's Luer in at the four slot. So Detroit will get the first possession. Jackson with it. Feeds it to Harris. Back to Jackson. Drummond the screen. Jackson dishes to Harris. Drummond. Back to Harris. Outside Jackson. Nice ball movement by Detroit. Bradley kicks to Drummond. And easy two points on the layup. Drummond's got the opening basket of the game for Detroit. And you've also got to love what a forceful low post defender he is. If he blocks one of your shots, you remember it. He sends him into the stands to make a point. Now here's Bradley. Drummond sets the screen for Bradley. Lock at six. It's Jackson with the drive. Some solid defense there from Jackson. There was just enough defensive pressure to get him. And moments ago, the national anthem and the mental preparation for the game ahead. Welcome to 2K Sports for another edition of NBA Basketball. This is Kevin Harlan with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg and our sideline reporter, Doris Burke. A quick check now for starting lineup for both teams. First for Toronto, Lowry and DeRozan, they're the backcourt. And they've got Lucas Nogueira, the big man from Brazil, in at center. Then it's Damari Carroll, and it's Ibaka in at the fourth. And looking at the Raptors, Lowry and DeRozan, they're the backcourt. And they've got Lucas Nogueira, the big man from Brazil, in at center. Then it's Damari Carroll, and it's Ibaka in at power forward. And so off the tip, it's Toronto. Now Lowry. Right side to Rosen. In low to Ibaka. Raptors moving the ball around. And Valanciunas with the block. Lowry against Lowry. Powell dishes to Valanciunas. Passes it to DeRozan. He kicks it to Powell. Back to DeRozan. Shot clock at five. At the lead pass. Valanciunas. A good finish at the rack off the slick feet. Pretty, pretty passing. Timely recognition as to where the open man was. Let's catch up with Doris from the side. 
and a good nature back and forth between the players while we wait to get this one underway. Let's get Welcome to Noche Latina here in the NBA. A Latin flavor to the night's festivity as we get ready to go. Joined in the booth with Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony, this is Kevin Hart. The starting fives for our game, here are tonight's starting lineups. First, for the Rockets, they've got P.J. Tucker. Each and every night, so important to utilize that size under the basket, and you know he'll be contributing in every way he can here tonight. Then there's Gordon, and it's Anderson in at the four. And looking at the Rockets, they've got P.J. Tucker. They'll be watching him boxing out, maneuvering for the easy baskets inside. They'll be counting, certainly, on his production. Then there's Gordon, and it's Anderson in at the power forward. Tip off goes to Houston. Harden with it. He kicks it to Ariza. Paul. Back to Ariza. Six to shoot. Paul with the screen for Ariza. And Paul over to help. Here's the three. And it's going to be a 24-second shot clock violation. They turn it over. Rockets ball. Anderson a screen on Paul. Harden outside. Pass to Ariza. Good. It's Harden with the assist that time. Ariza's got his first three points of the game. I like the offensive awareness to exploit that lack of coverage on that play. Mucho Gusto. And welcome to Noche Latina on 2K Sports. From the jerseys to the food to the halftime entertainment tonight, a distinctive Latin flavor. I'm Kevin Harlan alongside Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. Now a chance to check out our starting lineups. First for the Spurs, Parker and Danny Green are your one and your two. Then there's Ginobili, and it's Aldridge in at the four spot. And for San Antonio, Parker and Danny Green are your one and your two. Then there's Ginobili. And it's Aldridge in at the power forward. And it's going to be the Spurs off the tip. Parker outside. He feeds it to Green. Back to Parker. Here's the pass to Aldridge. Puts up the baby hook. Nice D from Aldridge. Right side Leonard. And he jams it with authority. And it doesn't really matter who starts the break with how he runs the floor. He seems to always be the one who finishes. Yeah, he is so fun to watch and how he attacks the rim at full speed. Welcome, everyone, to NBA Basketball here on 2K Sports. Tonight, it's Noche Latina, celebration of Latin culture in the league. It's become an annual tradition and a very good one. This is Kevin Harlan with Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. And joining us in a bit later from the sidelines, Doris Burke. We've got a chance now for our starting lineups from point guard to center. This game should be a good one. First for the Suns. Chandler out there with Booker and filling the paint out of the Ukraine by way of Maryland University. Skilled seven foot one pivot man Alex Len. Then there's Jared Dudley and it's Jackson in at the power forward position. And for the Suns, Chandler out there with Booker and filling the paint out of the Ukraine by way of Maryland University. Skilled seven foot one pivot man Alex Len. Then there's Jared Dudley and it's Jackson in at the four man position. So Phoenix will get the first possession. Ludzo against Ludzo. There's the dish to Warren. 
Outside for Bledsoe. Six on the shot clock. Blocked. Now here's Booker. He's guarded closer. And that one is stuck right through. Boy, oh boy, to be young again. <laughs> my, oh my. You got me thinking back to my day. Oh, yeah, right. It does make you nostalgic, doesn't it? Oh, well, man. speak for yourself. I, I could never throw it down like that, but I will say it sure looks fun, doesn't it? And so it's the Suns getting on the board first. And it's Bledsoe off the drive. Pass to Warren. For the three. No luck. And Phoenix the other way now. And both sides on the floor getting ready for the game ahead. And it's almost that time. Welcome to 2K Sports for another edition of NBA Basketball. I'm Kevin Harlan alongside Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. A quick check now the starting five for both teams. For Oklahoma City, they've got Adams. We will see him go to work on that low block. One of the great centers right now in the league. And it's Patterson in at the fourth. And for Oklahoma City, they've got Adams. He'll be looking to control the boards tonight and provide that key offensive production from inside. And it's Patterson in at the four. And so off the tip, it's Oklahoma City. Now, here is George. Passes it to Roberson. Back to George. Shot clock at six. And the layup's good off the glass. George has got the opening field goal of the game for the Thunder. You know, it's always nice to get the easy look inside for your first points of the game. It always seems to settle you down when you have some early success in the post. Now, here's George. Good! He's just such a well-rounded offensive player. He's got a little bit of everything. I also think he might have played a little football, Steve, because he's excellent at intercepting passes. I mean, that seems to be his call. And just a minute or two here for the players to get warmed up before the start of the game. Welcome to the NBA on 2K Sports. Joined in the booth with Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony, this is Kevin Harlan. A quick check now for starting lineups for both teams. First for the Timberwolves. We got Rush. He knows how to come up with the big plays and the big games, the rebounding, the inside scoring, and that looming presence. Then it's Gorgie Dent, and it's Gibson in at the four spot. And looking at the Timberwolves, we've got Rush. No doubt one of the premier big men in the league, a superstar talent all the way around. Then it's Gorgie Dent, and it's Gibson in at the four spot. So the Timberwolves win the tip. Teague with the ball. Outside Butler. Left side Butler. Shot clock at six. And he drops in the way up off the glass. Butler's got the first basket of the game for the Timberwolves. It's got to be nice for them to know that game in and game out, his offense is going to be there for him. Well, let's go to Doris Burke, who spoke with head coach Sam Mitchell. Uh, Doris, what's the news? I asked him about their defensive strategy, Kevin, and he said their number one concern was taking away any paths to the basket. He said, I don't care how far off them we have to play. We want them taking jumpers and threes, not running at the rim looking to throw it down on us. This is trying to take away their launching point, Kevin. All right, Doris. Yeah, good job to take it right at the defense. Yeah, really left him no choice there, Greg. He had the foul and keep him from converting the easy bucket. The Timberwolves shooting their first shots from the free throw line tonight. Yeah. 
And he knocks down the first one. Welcome, everyone. Thanks for tuning in to 2K Sports for another edition of NBA Basketball. Joined in the booth with Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony, this is Kevin Hart. And now we take a brief check at the matches. Our starting five for both teams. First for Portland, Lillard at the point with C.J. McCollum playing the two. And playing at the pivot, the 6'10 lefty big man out of North Carolina, Big Ed Davis. Then it's Alan Crabb, and it's Harkless in at the four. And for Portland, Lillard at the point with C.J. McCollum playing the two. And playing at the pivot, the 6'10 lefty big man out of North Carolina, Big Ed Davis. Then it's Alan Crabb, and it's Harkless in at the power forward position. And Portland starts out with the ball. And Turner kicks to Harkless. He passes it to Lillard. And the shot is good. Really well done there. Just confident and composed. Never in a hurry. On defense, the Trailblazers. Outside Turner. Nurkic setting the pick for Turner. Now the feed to McCollum. Pass to Harkless. The three-pointer no good. And here's McCollum. That's in and out. Doris Burke caught up with head coach Terry Stotts. DB? Yes, Kevin. And he said their preparation for this game was all about defense. Going up against one of the premier offensive teams in the NBA, he said, listen, it's a challenge that we need to embrace. Nobody can do it by the... And we see a while ago the Warriors getting prepared for the task at hand. Welcome, everyone. Thanks for tuning in to 2K Sports for this NBA presentation. This is Kevin Harlan alongside Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg. The starting five for our game. Here are tonight's starting lineups. First for the Warriors, Curry and Thompson, the splash brothers in the backcourt. We've got Ian Clark. He'll be battling under the boards to get the job done, both on offense and defense. And it's West, and it's Green in at the four. And for Golden State, Curry and Thompson, the splash brothers in the backcourt. We've got Ian Clark, a very solid big man who'll be making every effort to control the glass and make some big plays under the rim. And it's West, and it's Green in at the four spot. So Golden State will get the first possession. Outside Durant. Back to Curry. Green with a screen for Curry. Lock at six. Shots good by Durant. Durant's got the opening bucket of the night here for the Warriors. You know, his ability is matched only by his energy, guys. I mean, he's usually in the middle of everything for his team. Curry kicks to Pachulia. So the whistle blows on the shot and two free throws for the contact right there. No question, he got bumped on that. It's the NBA. Welcome to our Sunday night broadcast here on 2K Sports. I'm Kevin Harlan alongside Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. Our starting lineup to look at the matchups here and who we'll see for our starting five for both teams. First for the Wizards. Wall and Beal together in the backcourt. And playing at the five, a jump shooting seven-footer with underrated athleticism out of Colorado State, Jason Smith. Then it's Porter. And it's Morris in at the power forward position. And looking at the Wizards, Wall and Beal together in the backcourt. And playing at the five, a jump shooting seven-footer with underrated athleticism out of Colorado State, Jason Smith. Then it's Porter. And it's Morris in at the four. It'll be the Wizards off the tip. Washington. Wall passes to Beal. Burts out with the screen for Beal. He dishes it to Gortat. Outside, Wall. And there's the feed to Morris. Wall, shot clock at five. From eight. Wall with the steal. Morris with a screen on Wall. 
Left side wall. He feeds it to Beal. Connects on the 17-footer. Beal's got the first points up on the board tonight here for Washington. All right, let's go over to the sideline with Doris Burke. Gavin, Scott Brooks gave me a couple of minutes to catch up with him. When we talked about what they'll try... And welcome, everyone, to another presentation of the NBA on 2K Sports. I'm Kevin Harlan alongside Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. The starting fives for our game. Here are tonight's starting lineups. First for the West All-Stars. They've got Ginobili. Tonight, we'll see him work to establish that all-important presence under the glass. Then it's Curry. And it's Durant in at the four spot. And for the East, Jonas Valanciunas is out there with Jabari Parker. Then there's Kevin Love, and it's James in at the four slot. And the West All-Stars have possession. Durant kicks to Harden. It's Davis on the win. Passes it to Durant. Pocket six. Harden outside. And the rejection by Adekumbo. And it's going to be a 24-second shot clock violation. They turn it over. The West All-Stars on D. Outside DeRozan. Back to Irving. Right side, Irving. And off target as he starts the game 0 for 1. DeRozan against Harden. That's good. Defender a little.